What is up tech gang, Stefan here from TechRight. Today I'm going to be showing you gaming on the Huawei Mate SE. I know a ton of people were asking me what type of games uh, run on here. I know a lot of people were talking about Bullet Force, Dead Trigger, Asphalt 8, you know the usual games. So I'm going to go ahead and play some of these games on this device and show you how they run, see what kind of graphics we get out of them, and just see how they run on the phone in general. <laughs> Alright, so the first game we're going to go ahead and check out is called Flat Zombies Cleanup and Defense. This is a super duper addicting game. If you guys haven't checked this out, it is a game that is powered by Unity, but this game is super duper fun. You guys really need to go ahead and check this out. Uh, but it's kind of like a defense game. Uh, we're going to check out in corridors right now. And we have our guns right here. I've been playing this game for a while on this device and it's been running beautifully. Uh, we're going to go ahead and set this up though. Level 1. As you guys see, we can have the frame rate down there. We get in between 48 and 50 frames per second. Um, but it's more of like a zombie uh, post-apocalyptic game that you uh, defend yourself with guns and stuff. You can go ahead and upgrade and different stuff like that. Uh, but this game just runs very smooth. Uh, obviously not super graphic intensive, uh, but it it's, 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 it's a fast-paced game, honestly. I'm going to play this real quick for you guys for a little bit more, maybe past this first round. And the level is clear so as you guys saw the game ran pretty smoothly um, obviously with just this tab open you can have uh, a lot of other tabs open because this device does have four gigabytes of ram but we're gonna go ahead and go on to another game obviously i downloaded asphalt 8 so we're gonna go ahead and try that next uh, then after that dead trigger 2 and then bullet force that's more of an online game uh, such as um call of duty or something like that it's an fps these are two fps's and this is a racing game probably one of my favorite racing games um next to um a, there's one drifting game that i like that's really fun but we're gonna go ahead and check out the uh, asphalt 8 we're gonna play a round of this but yeah guys, we're going to go ahead and play a career match right now. We have the Dodge Dart GT on here. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and race some other cars real quick. Um, I've been playing this game for a while. Uh, I remember, you know, all the asphalt. So this is a really fun game. If you guys haven't played this game as well yet, uh, I do recommend downloading it on your new Huawei Mate SE. We are in Nevada. Um, but yeah, this is a really, really fun game. So I believe, yeah, you have to move like that. Um, so far it's running pretty good though. Like so far it's it's running pretty smoothly. Um, better than the ZT Blade Z Max, I can tell you guys that. Um, um, one thing that I noticed though so far is I am covering up the speaker. So that's kind of a downfall to this device is that you can cover up the speaker if you're not careful. Uh, but I, I honestly don't game without headphones. So I would recommend uh, putting in some headphones if you guys really are into gaming. And I think you guys already know that if you are super into gaming or whatever. Uh, but yeah, game runs pretty smooth. We're going to go ahead and finish this race real quick. Let's try to get the dub. So as you guys saw in that round of racing, I actually managed to get first place as well as, um, you know, this game runs pretty smoothly. Um, I, I see it running better than any of the prepaid devices out there in the game right now um, and really any budget device. Um, but yeah, best budget device so far for running this game. I think it runs it very smoothly and I, I managed to get first place right there. So. I think that is evidence in itself that it runs pretty great. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and test out uh, Dead Trigger 2 next. And a lot of people love this game, so we're going to go ahead and test this game out. Um, we have all the other games in the background, so just know that uh, as well. But we are going to sign into my Dead Trigger account. We're going to play a game real quick. Or a mission, I should say. 
and I did play Shadow Gun and other games like this on this device before and it, they have run really smoothly. I just really don't like um, some of the games that they have on here on, on the Play Store aren't too good but these select few I really like. Um, also like fighting games like Tekken um, and uh, the other Final Fantasies and stuff I do like so I'm going to probably go ahead and download these on this device pretty soon. Uh, but everything on this everything on this device so far has run really smoothly. This is an action adventure uh, zombie game. I'm pretty sure you guys already know that. Uh, first person shooter. We're gonna go ahead and blow that up. But as you guys see, it it, it is super smooth. Honestly, um, I really can't do a full um, intensive review on the gaming aspect of this of this phone you know other than if I had a temperature meter but uh, it runs really smooth the graphics look really nice as you guys can see um, honestly the graphics look like somewhat you know PS3 almost uh, they look pretty decent though we're gonna go ahead and finish up this mission though take out all these zombies real quick and Step over this, go around, go in this room right here, take out that zombie, and get the key. Pick that up. Bloop. Go back over here, open the door, and take all these zombies out. These are, this is also compatible with controller, so if you have a PS4 controller and an OTG cable or a uh, Xbox controller uh, with an OTG cable, this is going to work perfectly fine. But we are going to go ahead and get to the car, and look at that huge monster right there. Mission passed. So we completed the objective of this game. Uh, obviously it runs very smooth, good enough to play on it, you know, good enough for the average gamer to play on it, so uh, pretty decent. Alright, so the last and final game I want to try out on this device, uh, it's more of a multiplayer game. It's kind of different, you know, to other games. Obviously, you can play uh, multiplayer on Asphalt 8, but we do have a more, you know, I think graphic intensive game right here, Bullet Force. Um, if you guys want to go ahead and download this, it is on the Play Store and it is absolutely free. Uh, you can go ahead and play online with friends. You can have your gamer tags on here. You can have uh, in-game chat and stuff like that, but it is a super duper uh, fun game. So we're going to go ahead and log in right here and I'm going to go ahead and play a match for you guys real quick. And as you guys see right here, I am not BM BSing. I actually got to rank four right there. So I've played this game before. Um, hold on real quick. I think you guys can see right there but I have played this game before uh, I've been trying it on every single device I've been getting and yeah so we're gonna go ahead and do uh, maybe quick play or join a match actually and yeah we're gonna join a match real quick I think we have to pick a so we're gonna play free-for-all oh that match is full we're going to play so you can pick servers on here right now uh, as well so it's pretty cool the gun game so you're gonna go ahead and join a match and play the gun game uh, the gun game on here is similar to like the Black Ops gun game or the Black Ops 2 gun game where you advance uh, in getting better guns every single time you kill a person with a gun that you have. So um, there are really fun game modes on here and I really do, um, if you are a social gamer or a mobile gamer, I really do, uh, I recommend downloading this game. Okay, so the current weapon I have is the G18 uh, pistol. So we're gonna go ahead and deploy right now and let's see how this runs so far viewing is good uh, pretty nice okay so the match has started the running style is like battlefield or whatever kill the dude right there um, looks like we have a assault and submachine gun I guess um, let's take some other people out real quick Uh, we got killed right there. ZSC sensitivity is pretty great on this game.
Ah, oh, I get killed from behind right there. We have the scar. If anybody plays Fortnite, <laughs> I have the scar. I have the scar. I have the power now. Uh, but I haven't felt the phone get super hot, so it's been it's been pretty cool so far. And this is an all metal unibody um, phone, it has a metal chassis over it, so it's 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 been pretty cool so far. Honestly, running all of these games, got a kill. Back to the pistol. What? What happened? Ah, this is like a pea shooter. What gun is this? Headshot. Okay, we have a sniper now. Uh. <laughs> okay, so we came in at fifth place right here. Obviously, you guys see tech right right there coming in. We came in at fifth place, so it is possible to game on this phone, uh, and it actually works pretty good. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed that video, please leave a like down below. And if you guys have any more questions, please leave them in the comments down below as I will be trying out more games on this phone. This phone so far has been very, very nice. And if you guys are wondering what kind of launcher I'm running on this phone, I am running like a little pixel theme on this phone. If you guys want to go ahead and download the, the uh, MUI Themes Factory, that's a very, very good app. Uh, but this, this background or wallpaper, as I should say, uh, and these keys right here are like a little pixel theme or whatever but I thought it was really cool so I downloaded it but yeah if you guys are not a part of the tech gang already I would appreciate it if you guys can subscribe stay tuned for more videos like this this has been tech right peace out